dug deeper tonight on a story we broke for you last night. Crooks siphoning thousands of gallons of gas from at least two tri-state gas stations. Tonight we've learned it's been going on for more than a year. Night on your side's John Genovese joins us now live from the Clifton Shell with more. John. Well, tonight we've learned in a little more than a year, thieves were able to rip off around 400 gallons of gas from this station. And the owner says they popped open the pump, then messed with the metering inside. His total loss, around $10,000. And this is just one of the places they hit. This surveillance camera rolling on a rainy day last February. Watch as someone knocks it to the ground. In one frame, perhaps a shadowy figure. It's hard to tell. In the beginning, we were thinking maybe somebody, you know, off the road is uh, trying to steal the camera and sell it. Clifton Shell owner Bobby Koshal now believes it was the beginning of a sophisticated gas siphoning string. I'm still in process of checking how much, how many gallons we lost. A few days ago, a customer told him two pumps were fueling for free. A quick look inside, and this is what they found. The meter was messed with. The mechanic said it wasn't the first time. I couldn't sleep uh, last night because I was trying to calculate uh, how much I will probably losing it. His documents show in the last year, thieves took roughly $10,000 worth of gas plus the cost of repair. What we're trying to do is now trying to put a kind of a padlock on the top of it. But Sam Kitney tried that. He manages a different shell station some two miles away. The last time they come, they took out our locks and they put their locks. He says the siphoners hit his station at least four times in two months, most recently on Monday. That's when they took 600 gallons, valued at 2K. The monthly profit for the station is gone. So another couple times, then we have to shut down. Both men say they're turning over gas records to police. They believe a young group of guys are behind the scheme and a message before they come back. Be careful now. You know, we, we are also watching. Now, when it's all said and done between these two gas stations, those thieves were able to take around 7,000 gallons. To give you some perspective, that's enough to drive a sedan from here to Los Angeles round trip some 60 times. For now, reporting live, John Genovese, 9 on your side.